everyone, what about here, and welcome to Necronator Dead Wrong. This is a game that uh, came out like a week, week and a half ago, give or take. And it was one of those where they're like, hey, you want a press copy? And I was like, yeah. And then like, as I was hopping on the plane to Disney, they're like, here's your key. And I'm like, no. Anyway, uh, I'm back from Disney. We're here. We've got the game. Let's, let's get going. Let's see how this works. I honestly don't know too much about this game, apart from the fact that like, I saw a couple other people play it. It looked kind of neat. Reverse tower defense, question mark. And then I had like a number of people that were like, want to play this game? And I'm like, bleh. It looks like it might also be kind of a deck builder, which could be kind of fun. We'll see how this goes. Anyway. Number seven, Death Knight. Formerly a living knight on the quest for the Holy Grail. Currently an undead knight on the quest for the Unholy Grail. You will never meet a cursed crusader more wide-eyed with wonder. Or a student of sacrilegious scripture more eager to learn. For some people, death has the odd tendency to make life more enjoyable. Chubat's Conquest. The time is now. Let's embark on an epic conquest uh, Conquest to destroy the living seed. Cool. Oh, so is this actually a uh, rogue lady? Open a letter and says, Congratulations, you've just graduated from Undead Academy. As a freshly certified villain, prepare to embark on your very own quest for world conquest. The Academy hereby presents you with a patented soul spawn crystal. Please attach it to your arm, and the crystal will permanently bind itself to your life force. No substitutions or refunds. Two pets flock, this, uh, flock across the sky. One lands beside you, perching on a dead tree. Impressive, says the Chubat. You could be the next Necronator. You know about the Necronator, right? The Chubat looks at you. Greatest Dark Lord to ever terrorized the world. He lost his power a hundred years ago. Ring any bells? Anyway, lucky for you, I know how to reclaim it. I'm currently accepting work as a consultant for the aspiring tyrants. Well, I don't think I'm trustworthy. It's just, no, just to show I'm on your side. I'll give you a gift and go ahead, pick one. Craft a spell, utility or a squad? Utility. Uh, battle cry. Excellent choice, says the Chubat. Since you have accepted my gift, that makes us partners. I always give the best advice. You won't regret listening to me. Now, if you want to reclaim the Necronator's power, you first you've got to conquer a few towns, then defeat an army or two, you know, just to prove your Worthy. I'm sure an up-and-coming scourge to humankind like you can handle it. I should change his name. Or name, voice. Maybe flamboyant? I don't really know. What kind of voice should I give this guy? Maybe I should just go back to the previous voice that I was using. Maybe this guy sent us the letter. Oh well. There's so many dangerous an animals in the wild, says the Chubat. Creatures that would rip up in your throat like wet paper, but compared to you and me, they're innocent lambs. Show your enemies who's really dangerous. Enter battle. I feel like he's trying to seduce me poorly. Battle start. Okay. Until enemy reinforcements. Armor up. So, looks like I'm waiting until I have enough mana... ...to summon these things. Is that a temporary thing, or is that a con constant thing? Okay, overdraw a card, Blood Rage. Okay, it is a reverse tower defense. Do Blood Rage. Okay, that didn't work. Kind of awkward. I understand how this is supposed to kind of work. Oh, okay, so that worked. So by doing Battle Cry, they all got stronger. Let's probably get some Fletchers. I don't know if they'll catch up, though. We might honestly want to wait until we have 50 and drop both.
Or maybe even 70? Or hell, let's just keep waiting. Portal HP. Enemy reinforcements is probably the biggest issue that I'm going to have to deal with. Soldier. Okay, we're just going to we're just going to drop an army on these guys. We'll see how this goes. Looks like these are kind of tough. So it seems like Fletchers are worth grabbing. That range makes a difference. Okay, so looks like we wrecked that. Oh, and because we wrecked that, we actually get a, a bit of a bonus. I understand how this works. Well, this is actually kind of charming. It's a bit simplistic. I like the blending of 2D and 3D. But, like, it's... It's got potential. Okay, I'm just going to send a, a second group. It looks like these guys are doing fine. But that's fine. Also, I'm going to turn the game volume back up. It was super loud on the main menu, but now it's like, just like in the background. And we want a little bit more than that. Victory! Okay, I'm just going to switch the uh, the weird bats voice. Okay, extra souls or draft a card. Let's go extra souls and draft a card. Okay. AOE ranged unit. Hell yeah. What do you want? I don't even know what souls are. I guess at the camp, maybe? Uh, let's see. Restore, portal HP, upgrade, or remove. Upgrade. Okay. Uh, let's see. So, 70, 74. This guy's kind of expensive. If we upgrade this, we can do Deadly Fletcher, so more damage, or better crit rate and move speed. Go back. Let's see what else we can upgrade. I like the fact that you can upgrade them in different manners. It also looks like there's rarities. So more attack, more attack speed, uh, or armor breaker. Okay, let's keep looking. What about soldiers? Crit rate or attack? Armor breaker, stun attack. So I was kind of hoping to go for more, like, survivability more than anything else, but that's okay. The other one would be this one. Oh, 50% attack or attack and attack speed. I'm not sure if I care about this one too much. Uh, let's see. Oh, no, it does actually get tougher. Brutal or Pyromaniac. It just wasn't showing it as much. So if I take a look at these guys, 750 HP, as opposed to the basic 250. Oh, there's different soldiers that we could get. So, yeah, let's go with these guys. Because they have three times as much HP as they had earlier. Okay, we could go shopping next. Let's save our bits. We've got another shop that's unavoidable earlier on. What is it with the dwarves and mountains? Asked the Chubat. Couldn't they live somewhere else? Either easier to reach, like a nice level field of, fla of flowers. Fight your way through the next horde and keep climbing. I'll be your moral support. And to battle. Okay, so obviously mana generation is a bit of a sticking issue here, but it's okay. All right, let's save up for the Brutal Soldier and a Fletcher, and then wait. But yeah, this is actually not half bad. It The structure reminds me of uh, Slay the Spire in a good way. Okay, so we're going to wait just last second. And bam, and bam. Okay, let's slow them down. We don't actually want these guys to go very fast. We'll just overdraw. I guess I'll just blood rage a lot of them. Because if I can take this, we get, we get more stuff. Oh, god damn it. 
They're having issues. That's disappointing. Yeah, they were they were trying to shoot at each other, but because of the environment, they just couldn't. Bit rough. Oh well. This will get easier. I'm gonna probably save up for the demon mages. Go from there. Could definitely lose uh, live without the sound effects being as high as they are. Let's turn that down. I know a lot of people are like, turn the sound effects back up. We love them. And I'm like, what is wrong with you? I'm going to stand by that general statement. I don't know. I, I've never been a big fan of sound effects in games. Oh, boy. Okay. So we just need pure quantity over anything else. Because this thing is just going to be shooting my dudes. No. Nope. Yeah, it is. They have to take the long way around because they can't hit. Eh. Okay, so I can hit that. Not that that really helps too much. Okay, get them with the blood rage. Get them with the battle cry. Now they... Oh, they actually won't hit that. Interesting. Yeah, so they won't actually go for the, uh, they actually won't go for the, the, this thing. Once I've captured it, it's, it's just mine. Nice. I like that. Also, it looks like I was wrong. Uh, the, all, all soldiers have 750 HP. Oh, well. Anyway, we're just going to win this eventually, just through sheer, oh, that's how you redraw it. Got it. Oh, that didn't work. Victory through numbers and toughness. But yeah, the fact that not even my ranged units can hit this thing, but it, it can hit back is kind of rough. Okay, they're doing some damage to it, but getting around to that is... Ugh. If I could reorient my path, I think that would actually work really well as well. But I cannot. I'm curious and a little concerned about the enemy reinforcement situation. Okay. That'll get them there a lot faster. Get her done! Yeah, there we go. Man, I haven't... That is... Rednecks coming out a bit. Okay, uh, let's see. Fortifying Brute, Armored Brute. Melee unit, give all squads in your hand 50% H... Yeah, I like Fortifying Brute. Okay, question is, can I... Okay, so once I've upgraded a character, I cannot upgrade them again. So the question is, armor breaker, maybe. Ranged unit, uh, ranged unit. So same general deal. Question is, do we want more crit, or more movement speed, or more attack speed and attack damage? Maybe, what about the rest of these guys? Stealth, and deadly or tough? What else do we have? There's Battle Cry. I like the idea of Battle Cry. Do I want attack speed or just raw attack? Power overwhelming. Oh. Wait. Hopefully that works. If not, I'm going to be upset. Let's make a deal, says Grimbone the Swindler. You pay me, I'll deal you a card. It'll be fun, we both get something new. And who knows, you might be able to add another goon squad to your army. If it's in the deck, open the shop. Okay, uh, let's see. Blood Rage. Meteor seems kind of neat. I like 
the idea of the bomber. Let's grab both of those. Removing guards might not have been a bad idea. We're going to suffer from some heavy deck bloat here. But that's fine. Absurd, says Lord Balderdash. Villains who wait to stand in the cold. Not like me. I love the cold. And this isn't even cold. I'm sweating. I'm hot. Don't you dare say I'm cold. I'll teach you what it means to really freeze. Okay, battle start. Uh, where? Why am I over there? What is going on? Where am I? Why? How? What? Okay, okay, I can, I can rotate. That's good. This is confusing. Why is this here? Oh, you can change your path. I think I want the more direct route. I could be wrong. Okay, let's overdraw. Weren't we supposed to see his portrait there? It is an early access game. Give it a little bit of a... A little bit of credit. What are these things? They're like... Rams. I, I guess that's the point. Blood of Rage! More damage. Alright, and we've haunted the thingamadoo. And then we just wait for more. So we'll say, I don't think the armor breaker stun attacks were particularly helpful. Okay, there we go. Get the demon blades out. Okay. Don't know if that's worth it. Just send both of these... These weak boys. Okay, so give all squads in your hand extra HP. Is that for just playing it, or... I guess we'll find out. And we lost... We did lose the goblin after all. Well, it looks like the stealth dudes actually do a lot of damage. Pop that out. Strong battle cry. Bop of Fletcher. Wow. Oh, I'm glad I played that guy because the brutal soldier's HP is now kind of insane. So that's not half bad, actually. Uh, let's see. Let's... I wonder... Play him. We're nearly in Blood Rage territory. I'm just gonna zap them. Okay. Y'all just rush it. Okay, how are these guys doing? Well, the got the Goblin Bomber is about to get in there. Well, that, yeah, that got it. Alright, victory! I bet that battle warmed you up, says Lord Balderdash. Pathetic coward, need a battle to warm yourself up. I lost because I didn't need the extra body heat. It's my choice not to feel my toes or nose or anything. Alright, we get souls. We get to draft a card gladiator. Or fortify. Let's grab fortify. It's about the same effect, but it's cheaper. Beta assassination contract. Give units extra crit rate. Nice. Nice. Uh, let's see. I don't really feel about going shopping. This map gets a bit dense. I like beans. I like very dense memes. They take a while to get through, I guess. Alright, well, I guess we're going this way. So what do we upgrade next? 
Fortify. Uh, let's see. Oh, cheaper or plus five armor? Absolutely plus five armor. No questions. Okay, so if I keep going this way, I kind of want to do more fights. Uh, really? Oh. Hmm. I guess more camps. And more fights and camps and mysteries. Don't look like I get too many changes one way or another. It's 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 very much like Slay the Spire. You can't actually get extra no matter how well you route yourself. But yeah, upgrades seem to be fine. Anyway. If our homes are so peaceful and in tune with nature, why are they always attacking us, huh? Asked the Chewbat. Maybe because we're villains built, bent on world domination. Who cares? Too much for philosophy. I want to see some action. So is this from the Slay the Spire people because of the map? Nope. It, so, I mean, ultimately, it's, it's, F, it's FTL that came up with this mapping system specifically. Uh, we want to go the other way. Let's overdraw. And strong battle cry. There we go. Anywho, uh, it probably just seems kind of reminiscent purely because of that, uh, th that, like, branching map system, which I think is a really cool thing. I, I FTL was the one to pi pioneer it, and I give them major kudos for doing so, because, like, it really changed how like a lot of these games handle uh pathing and gameplay and some other stuff let's get him out i'm trying to save the fletcher and the brutal soldier and see if i can hit him with some other neat uh neat buffs okay blood rage Beat it up. Haunt the shit out of them. Okay, soldier. Nice thing is that'll just take pot shots at them forever and they won't fight back. Yeah, he ain't gonna make it, but that's okay. Uh, let's see. Just one dude. We can toss the demon mage. Okay, there's armored fortify. Hell yeah! That's what I was waiting for. Look at those beefy boys. I love it. I bet we could wait even longer and keep beefing them to the point of absurdity. But... That's a strategy for another time. So instead, we're going to further armor them up and make them painfully slow. Oh, actually, we're just winning up here. Turns out these guys... Oh, shit, they got distracted. God damn it. They're just like, hey, look, enemies over here. Wandered off. But yeah, it looks like you could potentially just keep fortifying your dudes, like, kind of non-stop. Which means what you almost want to do is get rid of everything but, like, one or two fortifying cards and just be like, I am going to have the beefiest goddamn goblins. Uh, let's see. Quick cast. I like quick cast. Grab quick cast. Okay, and let's upgrade. Quick cast. Let's do strong quick cast. Okay, and let's check out the mystery. Ooh. Potatoes, potatoes, as far as the eye can see. You stumbled across a potato farm in the 
Most improbable spot. These hardy tubers can grow anywhere. Your minions are salivating. Enter battle! Yes. Oh, upgrade a minion, then enter battle. Alright. Uh, let's see. So, increase his HP or his damage. That's. There's that. What about these guys? Stealth or stealth and poison attack? Maybe. Poison attack. Poison over time. That's eh, okay. What else we got? Yeah, more, more Daka. Ooh. I would add an AoE to it. There's that as an option. Uh, let's up these guys. And let's just up the damage. I don't know if Armor Breaker is the most helpful, but still. Let's see. Sour cream, butter, garlic halfway through the latkes. When you're still peeling spuds for steak fries, the farmers happen to return. They happen to be armed to the teeth. It's a good thing your army's well fed. At a battle! Let's see. As a wannabe variety streamer, how does one keep decent numbers? Uh, to have a YouTube channel. <laughs> I mean, it, it's a lot more complicated than that. Uh, and obviously, like, you can't just rely on that. Um, but a lot of... I owe a lot to... I, I mean, honestly, small amounts of community building. Absolutely. Okay, there they are. There we go. Uh, community building is huge. Um, trying to stay relevant. I try not to play a whole lot of old games. I try and cycle in new and interesting things because that usually does a fairly good job at keeping people around. We're going to try and beef this uh, demon mage up really hard. We'll see. Is this a tower defense game where you're the attacker? Kind of. I, it's like It's more of a tug of war game uh, than anything else. Blood Rage. He's not making it out of there anyway, so... Uh. He's a durable dude, though, dude. He's getting it down. I'll give him credit where credit's due. There's Armored Fortify. And there's Strong Battle Cry. My god, that orc, that orc just keeps going. Pop Overdraw. I should probably take a look at Overdraw, see if that's any good. Okay. Let's get a soldier down. They're getting a little aggressive for my tastes. Uh, let's do soldiers, no, soldiers first, because they're slower than the demon blades by a fair bit. Yeah, I, I want to see if I can hold on to, like, one of either the Fletcher or the Pyromani Pyromaniac Demon Mage. And, uh... I want to see if I can, like, uber buff them. There we go. This is a strong quick cast. So let's get rid of the Pyromaniac Demon Mage. Or get that out at least. Okay. Strong battle cry. Does it stack? It keeps... It seems to keep having an effect. So yeah, if you wanted to be an insane person, get rid of all of the unnecessary cards like Zap and maybe Overdraw and a couple other things and then just like pile on buff cards until you have just one punch Fletcher. Which is really amusing, actually. I'll have to look into armor up and see if I can get a better version of it. Well, I guess let's just bring the Fletcher out, because it's not, like... I think we're just going to win. We've got a uh, considerable amount of dudes... And, yeah, we are just demolishing them. Okay, 
So at this point, we would probably want to start removing some cards. Instead of just upgrading them. Because the upgrades are helping, but it's not actually that good. Like, this guy's okay. I'm gonna convert. Yeah. Let's see, do I want to go shopping first? Yeah, let's go, let's go shopping instead. 